HTC's popular sensation has been given a refresh with a slightly faster processor, Dr. Dre Beats Audio, and a slightly new moniker, the HTC Sensation XE. The beef that 1.5 GHz dual core processor really does the phone proud. We tried to tire it out by simply loading up as many memory intensive apps as we could, but it barely stuttered at all. Although the 4.3 inch QHD screen is the same size as the sensation before it, the display on the XE is noticeably brighter, giving us more vivid colours. HTC's inclusion of Dr. Dre Beats Audio makes the XE a media focused machine. The whole thing is slapped with branding and you get Beats Audio earphones out of the box, and it's worth it. The sound quality is noticeably better, especially on bass heavy tracks. Despite the battery life boost from the previous iteration, the XE still only gives you marginally more juice, struggling to stay alive for a full day of moderate to high usage. You'd be forgiven for thinking you were looking at the first gen HTC sensation with a bit of a spruce up on the case. That's because the size and the weight of the XC is identical to the previous model. Given it costs around a five or more per month compared to the original sensation, we have to wonder whether that faster processor and Beats integration is really worth the cash. There's lots to like on the HTC Sensation XE, including the souped up sound quality and speedy processor that whizzes through apps, widgets and internet browsing, but it was let down by a poorer battery life than we'd expect with the updated power pack. It should still last most of the way through the day though, and if you don't mind the slightly chunky dimensions compared to many of the super slim devices on the market at the moment, then you should certainly check out the HTC Sensation XE.